He lost that, but he's 11, 2, and 1 since that time. 2 and 1 in relief. So he has done everything possible for the Avalanche. Tate was deep into the zone. Wraps it up top, and the Avs keep it here. Giving off a race to the down low to Shushkin, trying to go in front, save rebound. Tip behind the net, it's McKinnon. Couldn't send that one out front. Nice job there by Lindblom to get involved in that. And here is Burakovsky. He's so due up to McCarr. One timer off the crossbar. Taves with a shot. Oh. And he knocked it wide. It was rolling on him. 7 7 1 on the road. They have one more game against the Eastern Pittsburgh. But at home here, they're undefeated. As it will dig it out and send ahead for Cadre up the middle. Cadre with a reshot. He scores! Mm. Nazem Cadre! Lets it fly as he got to the top of the circles, past the glove hand of Carter Hart. And the Avs have taken a 1-0 lead. Big goal for the Avalanche for a whole bunch of reasons. The Avalanche needed to get that first goal. They needed to set the tempo inside of this game. They needed to get some juice inside of this building. They've done all of that with Kadri's goal. Most you know that that's his 77th point this year in 60... It's stuffed away by Ristolainen. Ripped up top. It's McDermott Rishot. Save Hart. Rebound! It's in his gear and he'll hold on. Diving to his right to bring the whistle. Now Ristolainen. You mentioned the deals the Flyers did in the offseason. Ristolainen. Big part of that. Flyers walking inside. Pass saved by Francois. And he's got a hold of it. Oh my goodness. He's 26 years old. Granted it back into the Chushkin. Top of the circles and a shot there. And stopped by Hart with a blocker. Now it comes back to the Avalanche zone in a foot race. Van Riemsdijk with a nifty little shot. Scores! Van Riemsdijk gets his own rebound. He fights through both McCarr and Ranton in to put it home and tie this game at one. The most talented player, certainly on the Philadelphia Flyers. He's big, he's rangy, and right here, he just basically outworked two Avalanche players because the puck is there, and all of a sudden, people are pushing and shoving, but no one's really taking him, and he just gets the re gets his own rebound, fights his way through. No one really picks him. I think every once in a while you see it on the, on the big ball vision, and you go, oh, maybe I shouldn't have argued. McCarr with a shot. He scores! Right off the bat, Kale McCarr sends it down the slot. It's a power play goal seconds in and the abs have taken a 2-1 lead for the avalanche record for goals by a defenseman in a season and the abs defensive core now with 53 total goals this year also ties a franchise record it's been a long time coming and kale rips it home we saw van reemsdijk the one on two that he scored these are things that you know for coach bednar they you want to tighten up as you get ready for a couple of big games average wrist went off the leg Send in front, score! Terrific job by JT Comper. He stays with it. He's able to bash it home past Hart. The Avs have the 3-1 lead. Jimothy Timothy. And the Avs wouldn't give up on the play. And for the Colorado Avalanche, what they've done again is five-on-five five hockey. They get a goal. Comper from behind the net rolls it up and over. And Kadri is going to pick up Mosh. His third point of this period. But when he got some help off the stick of oh, Seal, yeah. it just rides up the defenseman stick. You want to look to your left, look to your right, and those guys are ready to play. And Cogliano is one of those guys. He will be ready. The Kenner Rick wide in front. Score! It was deflected! The Avs have taken a 4-1 lead. Ranton and threw it right to the top of the crease. I believe he'll get credit for the goal as it may have gone off a Flyers player. Wide open here in the first period of play. Well, I'm not sure what it hit. Hart seemed to, it seemed to hit both of Hart's pads, or at least the one, and it, and it went in behind. And But again, Johnson driving towards the net. You've got Nachushkin right down in front of him. Flyers trying to get something going here as Tippett flings it near side to far. Coming up the board to Sandheim, trying to keep it alive. Flyers with the backhand, flipping a save by Frank Soles, that puck over the top of the net. O'Connor showing the speed on Hayes. Couldn't cut it inside, but it comes to Manson, walks in and shoots! And a save by Hart, he'll hold on. 
<laughs> and puck sweeps to the corner. One handed up the boards. Cogliano finds his defenseman McDermott and he fumbled the puck. Watch out. Flyers have a breakaway opportunity. Wilman is in. Backhand opportunity to save there by Fransos. They're able to concentrate on a man with puck. Instead, they've got to turn and then turn back again. Elm wins the draw. Up to McDermott. Long shot. Score! Curtis McDermott from just inside the blue line. Let's it rip for his second of the season. The Avs have a 5-1 lead. We have a shot of it, Moshe. But you should see the bench when this goes in. It absolutely erupts. Because nobody works harder than McDermott. I mean... That now I hit, think that hit something, but it did not hit an avalanche. I don't believe. Well, the poor rookie Hodgson in the far circle just flopped out of the ice. <laughs> Almost a surrender move. I nothing he could do about it. This McKinnon was just all over. That puck picked up by York. Rips it ahead. Here comes McEwen in with McCarr on him. Score! McEwen with the tally with 31.3 seconds left here in the second period. What a goal by McEwen. Yeah, good, just a good, hard effort right here. Nice play at the blue line. Keeps the puck to the outside. I'm not sure where that... Does it go in between the legs? Oh, no, just the, uh, uh, to the far left side. I think if you're Coach Bednar, you'd say that the game perhaps has been a little bit more sloppy than you would like to see out of your squad. Sent by Hanson around the boards. Nobody home with the point. It'll come up and out. And out of the box is Jack Johnson. Back to Cadre it goes. Abs have yet to record a shot on this power play. They're more than halfway in. McCarr. Back from McKinnon. One timer. Saved by Hart. Rebound. Saved by Hart. And Cadre draws some attention. Power play is now over for the Avalanche. One for three on the night, given off far side, shot save, Francois back in and score! The Philadelphia Flyers bounce one down the slot. Max Wilman gonna score his third of the season. Now you're, you're gonna see that, but the man is wide open on the far side. Puts it on net and just grabs that rebound. It actually hit Burakoski's stick. Watch number 95, Burakoski. He comes across, and I believe it hit his stick. Supposed to be the Olympus, and it wasn't the Olympus. And he had to find and reassess and move games in, and they to do it all has been remarkable. McCarr, we see his way through. Shoots and scores! Kale McCarr run up the draw! He danced! He danced! He danced! And then he fired! And the Abs have taken a 6-3 lead for Kale McCarr. Goals in his season, he's got 24 the Avs have now doubled up the Flyers, and McCarr cannot be slowed down. And again, you're going to see McCarr get the puck. He dances in. There, there's three guys sort of around him. Their sticks are sort of there. Watch the sticks for the Philadelphia Flyers. There's one, two, three. And he just waits until the perfect time, up through a screen, up and over the shoulder of Harden, the Avalanche. So a couple of the Flyers who don't score a lot, They've got goals this evening. That's picked off. Here comes Kanak. Gives it off. Tip and shoots. Saved by Francois. And that was a golden opportunity for Philly. In the closing minutes of this one. Rob's Tippett abs on top 6-3. Like you said earlier, what he does is he wins. And he will here tonight down to the final three seconds in this one. And that will do it at ball rate off.